Hi everyone, today I'm going to be doing a butterfly inspired Halloween makeup look. It's a collaboration that I'm doing with Claire Delise. I, I hope I've pronounced her name properly. But it's been in the bag, planned for a while and I think because we're busy schedules it's been hard to do it. But I hope you enjoy. I'm doing a butterfly. I think she's doing some sort of sexy fish. But you'll have to wait and see. So anyway, starting with Urban Decay's Primer Potion and this is Sin. Now I need to get this all over the eyelid here. So I'm going to be bringing the butterfly right up. I'm going to put a bit under here as well. Wherever you think you're going to be putting some stuff, some colour. I'm just making sure I've got a primer enough so that it all goes on smoothly. And then I've even decorated my nails. Well, not decorated, but painted them with the colour that I'm going with. I found a beautiful butterfly. And it's the colour that really excites me the most, to be honest. It's, a, it's an awkward colour for most people, but I love it. So for the outline of the butterfly, I'm using this here. It's Max Super Slick Liquid Eyeliner. And I'm using this one because the Paris Berlin one I had, I've pretty much ran it out into the ground when I've done the Halloween look before. So I'm going to just use this one. I'm just going to draw the basic butterfly shape, starting from just above the brow. I'm going to incorporate the brow into the look. Once you've got both sides done, I'm going to just bring this down. Just join that up like that. I'm just making the brows nice and dark and I'm using this, it's Max Carbon, I'm sure it's Carbon, it's a matte black and I'm just using a huge big brush, sorry a big big brush just because it gets it on there quicker and I want to get it right all over the outside so there's like a dark going on. So I'm just going around the edges but inside. Now for the next bit I'm using a very 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 light blue and this is the, this is the one I'm going to go almost like a turquoise blue and it's out the big cheap manly palette. Now I got this palette off eBay ages ago for about £20 plus shipping so very very cheap. I'm just putting the blue about start from the corner the inside corner and just bring it out. I'm going to just blend that up and into the black and then just underneath and I'm going to be using I think this one here this looks like a nice one doesn't it to go really dark sea blue so there we are and that's a matte and I'm going to just apply that underneath the eyebrow bone and the eyebrow from room and then again just working it around and you'll see the colours come together. See? It's very nice. It's like a violet blue. I'm using all the manly palette because all the blues that I'm after are in this palette. Which is great. Now I'm using the tape ad blending. Because now is the time where I'm going to just gently add tiny little touches. And I'm popping it just on the side here. Don't worry about your lines being messy because we're going to be putting something over that and it'll hide it all. It was just to get a rough, get it on there and then I've got something to work with. And I think when you when you work like that and you're, you're not too worried, I think it works better than if you you put too much worry onto it kind of go wrong. I'm just adding a couple of accent blues around what I've got already. Once you've got all your colouring on and you've put your little accessories on the side we're going to just draw a line on the eyelid so it's right from the inner corner out and we're going to take this right out of the outer corner So 
So from this angle here, I'm going to bring it in to the bottom there and just draw a line. Right around the outside, I'm going to be putting some of this. It's by NYX and it is a lush glitter. This one's Disco Queen. I'm going to give it a quick shake and then I'm going to just kind of draw around the outer, outer part of it. Just to give a little bit of a glitter. And then I'm taking the L'Oreal liner, the black one. Okay, I'm happy with that. And now I'm going to put a little bit of glitter on that, just a tiny touch. Now for your lips, I'm using this here. And it's by MAC, it's the Lip Erase and it's dim. And it's quite good at getting rid of all the colouring. Ta da! Look at that. Here we go. NYX. This one here is Hot Candy number 11, and it's the glitter liner again. And there you have it. A super sparkly butterfly. Makeup tutorial in collaboration with Claire Delise. Can't wait to see what she comes up with. And I hope you enjoy both the videos put together. And I shall see you all in a bit. Zoom, zoom.